Well, hello everybody. My name is Polymath Author, and today I'll be doing another book review. Remember to like and subscribe just down below. Remember, this video isn't sponsored or anything like that. Also, spoiler warning, there is nothing that will harm the story of the book that may spoil the overall theme of the book. Do not spoil any cliffhangers, put important details, though just the storyline and the overarching theme. Today's book is called Tomorrow When the War Began by John Marsden, which is the first book in the Tomorrow series. This book has been made into a movie. I read this book and it was really exciting, with a heck of a lot of action, and it felt like you were really there. I would recommend this book for people between the ages of 13 and 17, though you could be a bit younger than that. 13, being a vivid and confident reader, because of some adult jokes and references, and possibly some swearing, I'm not sure about that. Just a quick rundown. Ellie, a bored, high, a bored high schooler, decides that on the celebration day at her town, she'll just skip it and gets plans to go up with her friends up a mountain to camp. She convinces six others and they go up the mountain. They find an uncharted place named Hell and decide to set up camp. After a while of camping, planes fly over and they find out when coming out of Hell, all of the power is off and everyone is missing, captured underneath the stadium. They decide that they needed to get supplies and they go back up to hell after that. The rest of the book is them going up and down the mountain, finding a new person and also grabbing supplies and rebelling against the invaders. Not much is known about who the invaders are yet, but they keep on track. One of the friends gets a bullet to the leg and at the end of book and at the end of the book the two friends go a uh, two of the friends go to the enemy hospital because one of them was shot. I hope you found this book of you helpful and see you next time. Remember to like and subscribe. Keep it smooth. Bye.